This illustration deals with loading switches. In accordance with NEC 404.14, B is in boy 2. Now notice in the NEC loop, if you're uh, wanting to review uh, a disconnect for a sign, say, 600.6. If you want to review the requirements for a disconnect for a controller, 430.83 and 430.102. Motor disconnects, 430.109, if it's horsepower rating. If the disconnect for the motor is load brake type characteristics, 430.110. Now we kind of uh, illustrate that uh, in the loop so that you refer you to these sections quickly if that be the case. Now LEDs, you have that type of lighting, you're going to look at 430.136 and four th uh, or 410, excuse me, 410.136 and 410.137C. Now notice here we're dealing with an AC-DC switch. Now we pointed out earlier in the presentation of chapter 11 that an AC switch you could load up to 100% with inductive loading. But if we should have inductive loading uh, with a, a, say a DC switch or uh, AC DC switch rated type switch, 50% loading. So uh, the question is in your problem now, let's, let's look at it. Can a 20 amp AC DC toggle switch supply a 10 amp inductive lighting load? So to apply the 50% rule in accordance with 404.14. B is in boy two. Step one, we would take 50% of 20 amps, 10 amps. So the solution and the answer is uh, yes, we, we could uh, take 50% of that switch and feed inducting loading and take the other 50% say, and supply DC loading as you see in the illustration above. If we are, uh, if it's a 20 amp, toggle switch and you have fluorescents and LEDs and so forth uh, and it, they're classified as inductive loading, then that's where the 50% rule would come in. To the left, you're only uh, applying uh, incandescent lighting, so 15 or 20 amp uh, AC DC uh, toggle switch can be loaded to 50% of its rating when used to control fluorescent lighting. But you could use 100% of it, uh, you know, for DC incandescent type lighting that would give you a DC type effect. So uh, this uh, uh, figure 11-40 just simply deals with loading switches when they're AC, DC rated. Now, uh, what's important is that uh, when an electrician is uh, uh, taking a toggle switch, and switching lighting loads, be sure you know, is it just strictly AC rated? Is it DC rated? Or is it AC, DC rated type switch? And remember, sometimes as electricians, you go into existing installations, and these switches are already there. Uh, they're existing. So uh, that, that's basically uh, what this illustration is illustrating. And you can see the switch to your right is supplying fluorescent lighting uh, uh, by the requirements of 410.130, 410.140, and then to the right, if you was to have some LED lighting, then it's 410.116C as in car. Now, this uh, illustration, 11 40, just simply uh, uh, illustrating loading switches based upon the type of switch it is in accordance with NEC 404.14 B as in boy 2.